Hi Vikepaws lover. It's the Vikepaws tutorial here. This video is going to show you the custom fields of Vikepaws. Let's get started. If you are new to our channel then please click on subscribe button and hit the bell icon to get more updated videos. And if you are already a subscriber to our channel, then thank you so much for subscribing. From the admin panel, we have a menu named Custom Fields. Here we see the custom field list that we have created previously. Now we create a new one. First, we have to click on the Add Field button. It will open a from which contains label of custom field, type of field, whether it is text box, drop down, check box, or radio, etc. Then we have option where it will show. It have two option one is user module and another is customer module. Here we select customer module. If we enable half field length it takes half length field otherwise it takes full length field. Then we enable an option if it is required or not. If we enable is required then we need to fill up during form submission otherwise we can't submit the form without filling the field. Keep status enabled. If it is enabled, then it will be shown. Otherwise, it will be hidden on the selected from. Click on the Add button to add a field on the list. Now we go to the pause. Here we can add customers during the payments or we can add customers on the customer module. Go there and click on Add Customer. On the add customer from we can see the recently added custom field and the previous custom field. Now we are given the information and add a new customer to the list. That concludes our overview of the custom fields of Vikepaws. We hope you found this video helpful. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe for more updated videos.